still hello guys um i've been playing dota lately and i've been experimenting with different champions and i tried death prophet well even though i lost like two games and win three um all of the games i played i have like really impressive uh, kds for myself um 18 kills on this one this is my first game with her and then 16 and then 13 to 8 is not not so good but my um uh, yeah i was just learning i guess and this guy was smurfing this game another game well i was 15 to 0 then i died 10 times because uh, i started to learn that you can throw the game really easily as a this champion and this game this game was like for example um, I was straight up diving this guy in the last game too. Um, I was literally keep diving this guy. Um, for example, this game, uh, I don't know if I can, yeah, I can show it actually. Like level three, he, uh, I killed him. He teleported back and rushed to me, like ran really fast to me and he died again. And I'm going to show you how to do this because this champion is super strong. While I played last night, there was an update. And after the update, she got a buff. Like, this is not even fair. Like, I was playing while she wasn't buffed. And they give her, her a buff. So, it was only these two. Now, there is a new morning ritual. And I pick over this. Like, this is really strong. This makes her take the damage really delayed in 5 seconds. Which is so, so strong. Because she can, she can just siphon. She has Spirit Siphon that heals her massively, and you can like dive on level 2 and 3. Okay, now I'm gonna go into a game and show you the rest, and there is different buffs I'm gonna show you in the... Uh, I don't know how to really show it. No, let's go into the game and I'll uh, tell you about it more. So... Um, Death Prophet was banned after like uh, I queued up so I had a one hour painful game and I lost it because like that's the only reason I want to play mid this champion is just... the battle begins. and she's she has extended range now because she's buffed uh, yeah I don't want to take too much damage here. I'm gonna lane soon. Oh. So they're committing, committing. Deal damage then. So we're playing against Lone Ranger. Okay, she wants to fight. So, what I want to do here mainly is make a minion low. Then Q, her, and the minions, and the last hit the minions while I do that. So as long as you have mana in the lane, you're basically immortal. I'm not really farming well right now. Um, but I have my siphon now. When you have a siphon, it's just too easy. I'm siphoning her, poking her, bye bye her health bar. Unlucky, she didn't die, happens. The last hit and hit her. I don't know, um, she's keep healing so we need to get some healing too. When we get our bottle, and when we have mana, she just cannot ever kill us. Like, as long as she doesn't like silence us, pushes us, and whatever. But if I can E her, she cannot do much. Fresh blood comes with the first breath of winter. Okay. So, yeah, I'm not doing a great job at all right now, but it's no worries. So, we have mana. 
I'm gonna go and fill my HP on her. Like that. I'm under the This champion just gets really really strong. Like in no time. Oh yeah. Last game was really painful. I cannot really play right now, like last hit or anything. But like, as uh, we're gonna have our bottle, we're gonna grab runes, and when we have mana, we're gonna dive her. Really early on. Okay, now we get it. Denied. This ward. Okay. Let's get our bottle too. Okay. Oh, she sees it. Okay, she's really low now. Let's get more. I will what? Try to break it? So we're gonna dive her now. Holding on. Now I'm gonna fortify. Oh shit. Yeah, that was. Fortify was like bad, but. We just shit on her like that. She cannot do much. Yeah, this is what you wanna do mainly, and like there is no lane that I lost even though I'm a noob. <coughs> it's really easy, really straightforward, and really, really strong. Basically do that every game and win every lane. She TPs back, she tries things. I have my ultimate now. I'm gonna make minion low. If she shows up I'm gonna cure it. I'm gonna siphon this to heal up. Alright, so she disappeared, so we ping it. Okay, she's back. I see Dive her here. Easy peasy. Like, literally super easy to do this. She cannot really do much. Even if I didn't haste, as long as she doesn't like run super fast like Wind Ranger or anything, she cannot do much. She's gonna die anyways. And I, yeah. Uh, only, only you can mess this up with not having mana. But uh, when you have your early bottle. It's not also a problem. Okie dokie, so we get we get this first. I'm usually going and collecting these to replenish my bottle, 
This is also a good strat in my opinion. We didn't even ult it yet. Because we don't really have too much mana to spare, but... Super easy to grow. Like this is just super OP. Like I'm, <laughs> I'm not even like breaking a slip here, and I'm crushing her. Super good wave clear. Super good healing. The ult is really good too. Champion is just so lowly. And she doesn't get banned often, like, that was the first time I, I see her getting banned. That was kind of weird. But she's game is over right now. As long as I don't mess up, and, like, let her recover, she's game is really over. So I'm gonna I'm gonna ult for this tower I guess. Yeah. Breaking this tower is really important. Don't know where she went. I still have my siphon. Dead again. Oh no! But, aw man! Doesn't really matter, but. Yeah. Maybe I can silence her. Don't really need magic resistance, so I'm gonna open that instead. And my uh, courier died from nothing, it was kinda bad too, but at least I grabbed my thing. I'm just gonna continue dominating her. She cannot really do much. We killed her right here on like Your minute 10. I'm gonna constantly push mid, constantly pressure her so she doesn't recover. She can't grab all the things anymore, it doesn't really matter. Roots. Oh, there is a person. It doesn't matter, I kill them both, if it comes to that point. Ah, unlucky. This champion is way too strong. It's not even funny. Oh. And she is buffed, that's just way too funny in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah bro, you can dip. They cannot do literally anything. As long as I have mana, of course. I don't have my siphon, so I'm not gonna commit anything. I might die here if I commit onto her. So I'm gonna play smart. The siphon is so strong, we keep that in mind. <coughs> and we walk away from here. Okay. 
she shows up here, she dies. <clears throat> I'm gonna constantly push the lane, make, make enemy other laners come here and try to like kill me. So my uh, laners just plays really like easily. They don't like struggle. Just gonna constantly push. I'm gonna buy a ward, and I'm gonna ward their jungle. <coughs> Like right now they constantly say like your mid tower under attack, your mid tower under attack and eventually someone's gonna show up here. I really hope. Your tower has fallen. Well if I didn't do that, he would die. Yeah, easily dominating. I'm coming for this guy too. Super easy peasy. Um, enemy started to break as if she is as if she was doing great against us. Whatever, we don't judge people. We just crush them like this. Like so easy, so simple, so fun. Yeah, she she's getting fed though. Even though we crushed her. <clears throat> Let's finish this item. Oh no, no, wait, yeah, this. I have my ultimate. They can come like five people, I will kill them all. I need wards, I'm gonna ward their jungle and clear their jungle meanwhile too. I think there is another minion wave coming. I'm gonna play a little bit careful here until I have my item. I don't want my courier to die. And like they have to come, all of them has to come to me. Gonna keep push, keep deny minions. So, we go here. Ah, I should have been silenced her earlier. Doesn't really matter. But she will be dead. So, I open up my shield and the R egg here. And I'm taking their mid tower. They can fortify. Doesn't matter. Now they have to like respond to me, I think. <clears throat> so no one is showing up. Yeah, this is what I expected. Oh my fucking god. Ah, she's so angry. I'm gonna kill all of these guys. <laughs> oh my god. I don't have siphon, so I get it my run now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
Yeah. We made the enemy mid lane cry right here. Literally. Sorry, not sorry, I guess. Um, yeah. So let's look for ruins. I need, uh, I need my mana back to kill them. <laughs> yeah, there is no ruins yet. Maybe like in 20 seconds. I'm gonna push this again. I'm not gonna let her recover. I'm not gonna let her have help. I'm try. I'm not. I'm gonna try to like play it safe because when you die one or two times, even though I'm like 10 to one right now, I do something stupid and die. I I, I might like lose the game. Easy peasy, literally. Uh, that guy comes and dies too. I'm gonna check the rune. Okay, he's, he wants it. Yeah. I don't know what they hoping for. But... So you want to clear up the whole way with one skill, mainly. Do we have the many? Yeah, we do. Okay, we have our item too, right now. That's amazing. I shall bide my time. Okay, okay. So, I have my ultimate. I'm gonna have my... Um... Shiva's guard, too. I'm, I'm gonna... Save some mana. Like, be ready. Oh, there is a fight breaking up. Let's just kill them all, I guess. Ah, oh, I missed it, bro. How can I miss that? Like, I, I was trying to hope to land it on both, but it's okay. That was a 1v5, and we almost killed all five if I had my siphon charges. So let's fix that. Let's get a him shard, and we're gonna have extra one siphon. And I will never die. <laughs> Literally. Like, this game's, um, like, items are kind of situational. Like, for example, they're, like, mainly three damage like um, what do you call it for armor if there was like so much magic uh, resistance I'll just buy the second because this is also really really strong but you have less damage in effect like that she's just so strong to, like super abusable especially the, the buffs she had like literally this is double the uh, double the range oh I cannot speak really it, it, literally it's double the range it's crazy uh, this champion didn't need that at all just go away this should make Let's my push life lanes. Easier. This guy has no idea what to do. He just wanna like run down mid, but he's gonna make me ki get killed too. I feel like. Oh my god! It's like push here. Yeah. Thank you. Bottom tower has fallen. Oh my god, I don't understand. Why is this guy here? Like, you didn't help me all the game, now you're helping me while I'm just like 19 level and minute 12. So yeah, I just don't want to die um, ever in this game. <clears throat> because the more I die, the I can just literally lose my lead really fast.
guess she's crying really hard. Holy fuck. Oh, there we go. Well, for context, I played League, Challenger and stuff, so like, I didn't play much Dota, it's not a new account or anything, it's just, this champion is strong and really easy, that's why I want to emphasize here, not like just you 1v5 Penta kill this champion, yeah you can't really easily in my opinion. Um, yeah, champion is broken, and if you have like the fundamentals of mid lane and stuff, you just crush people like they're nothing. Yeah, like, this 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 guy is really funny. It's like, report, report, report. But you did that. Like you made me get this fed, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna wait for my exorcism. Like, I'm not gonna commit anything hardcore. But like, they just cannot kill me when I have my siphon. That's just how it works. And they just don't know that. Okay, I'm exorcism too. Oh no. Ah. Yeah, you don't want to do this. And you don't want to do this too. Like, while five people bought, they should have been, like, pressuring. Like, anywhere. Why they're not taking this, though? What they doing? <laughs> yeah. This is how you lose games. Like, even if you... Even if I'm, like, 21 kills right now, I die, like, two more times, like this. Like, um, micro mistakes, mechanical mistakes, doesn't really matter. And you lose. You lose the game. Because, like, they have carries. They have, like, Drone Ranger. Like, uh, Monkey King. Like, any of them gets fed. It's a, it's a big problem. We have mainly, like... I don't know what if this guy is a support and whatever he is. Oh, look back. Yeah. In some games, you just have, like, three more supports on your team that... Doesn't really do much. And like all of your lead goes to trash. That's quite sad when that happens. Yeah, I think you kind of in this though. The enemy's top barracks have fallen. The enemy's top barracks have fallen. Yeah, so. Yeah, this champion is a little addictive, by the way. I only play Dota to play this champion now. It's really easy, really relaxing. But, and to, when you like going into the late game, it gets like a little. It gets a little hard because your damage is not enough, you have to constantly Q and Q and Q. And like, you gotta experiment with the right builds. And shit like that. I'm gonna just R here and take their tower faster. Yeah, I know they're gonna focus me. 
Uh, Bla Black King Bar or whatever that item is could have been a smart investment here. I don't want to risk dying. We already took so much from them. Oh my god. Okay, I died, I guess. Oh, I did not. Came again. Yeah. This is how you lose games. I don't understand why my damage is super low suddenly. Like, they build magic with us. No. I, I, I probably buy something wrong or not enough damage. I don't really know, but it's not really important. I showed what I want to show. I could have finished the game when I was here crushing them. Now, we kind of like slowly getting team dependent here. We, you don't want that in your games. If you want like a high win rate, if you care, you don't want to get really team dependent in any point of the game because they're gonna do shit like this. They're gonna just chill in front of the market like this for 30 minutes and then walk to the push lane and walk back. Or this guy. They just like, <clears throat> I don't know. Like, I bet these people already has like a lot of games. Yeah. yeah. They have like so much more games than I do. Like look at my games. Look at these guys' games. And they're they're still chilling. Like look at Wait <laughs> What are you even doing man? Why are you chilling there? Yeah. Stuff like this happens, the Rover Ranger is fed now. I'm real strong, but my team is not. Um, I guess happens, it's not really important. Great. Um, let's play with PV. They're gonna like focus me like all, uh, all five of them together. I wanna push bot, so I take this. I don't think I have enough damage to kill Drone Ranger anymore. She's 21. Like you wanna keep the level gap is really high. Like I'm, of course I can't kill anybody, but I'm, I have to think to 1v5 situation all the time. And generally I'm gonna be silenced or other stuff or stunned. Yeah. So let's get this. Let's not troll anymore. I'm also trolling a lot this game since the beginning. Even while I'm farming, I'm just trolling. I don't know why. Because when you have a one hour game, I think, it makes your brain melt a little bit. Okay. So, we go to investigate that. Let's not troll more. Let's just try to end the game. They're trying really hard, they really want to win this. But I doubt that. Where is that? Uh huh. I did want to try this. <laughs> yep. So 
that's how you literally have a free MMR in Dota 2, literally. Like, this is all you need to do. You can, uh, you can do this every game. Every single game, you can just go and do that. That was an easy game. You can get a um, rapier, I guess. That item is really good when you like this fed, like I am. And you can get to shoot early and like have an impact on the map. Um, yeah. Like, you can kind of decide the way you want to play the game. <clears throat> um, if, if I was like in a better mindset, I think. I'll just go for the shoes early and go dominate the lanes, but mid pressure is really, really important in this game. So I got, I suggest you guys to pressure mid really hard. It doesn't matter if she gets like 13 kills. If I die like two more times, three more times, this game will be so different. So like, you gotta be sure you have your <coughs> um, <coughs> siphon and exorcism ready when you like won't try the 1v5 and try to like lend this as much as many people as you can um and i i don't know i, I don't know about, about like game a lot but i really suggest you play with this this is really bad this is meh but this is amazing like this makes you survive like so many situations in my opinion yeah this is how it goes um, thanks so much guys for watching.